Hello, everybody. Uh, we're here with the uh, De La Salle Green Archers. I'm Ben Phillips. I'm Michael Phillips. Jeremy Robinson. Shawnee Wins. And we're just here to recap some of the moments uh, post Ateneo La Salle rivalry game. Mike, right what here. are some of your initial thoughts? Right here. On oh, yeah, hold on. Only. Before we start, we just got to say some things. Yeah, let's say some things. Uh, we're just doing this because it was a big win uh, for the team. For and we the have community. A, for the yeah, community. For the community. So, and we just wanted to document it because one day we'll look back at this moment and... Uh, reminisce on things like that. And Absolutely. So, yeah, I feel like this is like a, a memorable thing, even though it's like a small stepping stone for our season. It's only the third game, but just something for the community to get the behind the scenes of how it felt to to play out there and some stuff that yeah. uh, y'all didn't y'all didn't see on TV or anything like that. So we just wanted to give you guys more information, especially with the big rivalry. So it's nothing to brag about or anything like this. It's just just to talk about it and get the behind the scenes with the players. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Basically. And you want to uh, translate that to Tagalog? <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, Mike. What is one of some of your ano, started off? Big sa akin naman, talagang, ano, masaya talaga ang feeling kanina nung nakita ko yung buong Lasalle community andyan. Um, lalo na after the game when we did uh, our um, alma mater. Alma mater. Uh -oh. and we saw the whole entire community, you know, together. That's something that we... We were only able to experience this year. E even last year, you know, we need them on full capacity. But mm -hmm. uh, Lala Nasa Araneta, that was all our first time playing in Araneta uh, in the UAP. And so um, I got chills, talaga. Like, mm. na, 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 this is what it means to be like a green archer for the community, like what you're really playing for. So um, I, I just want to know, like, the community, especially the fans, the crowd that really has such an impact on the game and how much we. Really play hard and need mm. them to not be able to court because they are Man. Yeah. That was beautiful. I never <laughs> <laughs> Even though I don't understand anything you're saying, it sounds amazing. <laughs> All right. So. Good cow, bro. Yeah. Major respect, Tata, now. But Ben. Starting off the game, uh, huh? <laughs> I, mean, I had to talk about that. I said, "Are you bald, Ben?" I'm, a, I'm over here. Yeah, yeah, I'm no. like, um, it, was warm -up. it was the warm up. But, uh, it was the warm up. It was the warm up. What, what happened in warm up? Uh, you know, see, see, Jeremy was was really helping me in warm ups. You know, coming off of whether it's just pick and roll action or, or spot ups, and uh, that's something I really wanted to work on, especially coming into this season, uh, last season, Daba. I wasn't really doing a lot of offensive production, you know. But uh, this season, I know since uh, we all had to step up. You know, with um, with with our goal this year, Deba. So I, I I wanted to add that to my to my game, and I've been putting a lot of work in with with Jeremy and and Coach Noy Falco Santos working on that three point shot. So it was just so bright. I say a young feeling, Kanina, like in the opening game, uh, the opening tip off, just to kind of get in my rhythm early, coming off of Mike's pass and then Deshaun's pass. So uh, I'm just happy I was able to knock him down. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. The way you shot hey. that, I was confident. I, was like, <laughs> I said, "Yup, this is going like, in." We was working too hard in one month for that shot. I was like, "He's shooting it." I was like, "I was like, go ahead, keep shooting." Yeah. Yeah. I was like, "Keep shooting. You, you bringing us? <laughs> keep shooting." <laughs> Smooth swish. That's oh, insane. Right. So, Jeremy, you, you up next? I, I, yeah. What could, what could you see? What could you see? I don't know. What was your whole experience going to the yeah. first? This is your first ever. College at, arena, yeah, at the nail, La Salle, yeah, right, drums, a rivalry sold out. That's not a high school game. What was your first? My experience going into this was I'm not even playing and I'm nervous walking into the game. <laughs> I walk outside, I see all these fans. I'm like, dang, this is crazy. Like, I've never seen so much people in one arena. I didn't know a La Salle to nail rivalry was that big. I'm over here, like, damn near, like, had the chills, like, in one, but it was so crazy. It was like. Never, I never, some experience I'd never seen before. So, like, during the game, I'm so locked in. Game, you know how the game was back and forth, it was going crazy. During timeouts, I'm in, I'm in the auto. Oh, like, oh, 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 hold on, hold on. We got to explain this better. All right. So, we started off, Jeremy, I text Jeremy. I'm like, Jeremy. Oh, you want me to start from the game? No, nah, I'll start it. I was like, Jeremy, where's my dad sitting? I was okay. like, just texting, where's my dad sitting? Jeremy's in the stands behind the basket. I get subbed out for the first quarter. I feel someone pat me on the back. Oh yeah, I forgot. He said, "Hey, bro, <laughs> keep your head up." I said, "Jeremy." <laughs> Later on in the game, I'm bumping into Jeremy in the tub in the huddle. I said, "Then in the real clutch time, Jeremy over here looking at the play, talking about, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's, 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 that's the screen. I was locked in. I'm in the huddle like I'm playing, so looking like I'm, I'm looking at the plays and stuff. I'm seeing the he whole thing. He drinking all the Gatorades and everything. He was drinking the Gatorades. Like, crazy. Dang. I'm like, yep. 
Yep, we're at 23 on the screen. Yep, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> one of the players, one of the um, teammates, they had to move me out of the way because I'm like, oh, shit, I forgot I wasn't playing my yeah. <laughs> Go ahead, go ahead, lock in. You can look. I'm not playing this year. Go ahead and do your thing. But yeah, it was, man, it was a crazy game. It was amazing. It was a great game. All right, so Mike, there was an incident <laughs> today. Oh, man. Oh, what, what happened? All right, no, 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 no. What happened? Yeah, I mean, actually, this is this is a real time Kai Balloon guy. You know, says great game, bro. Can't wait for the next one. Hey, man, shout out. You had a great game. Yeah, he was really yeah, I mean, yeah, you, yeah. you was uh, you you was nice. So we we going we gonna get that next matchup for sure. Who who shot at us? Who who shot out? Kai number one. Number one. Ah, oh. yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right, so Mike, for people that don't know, this smile is a little altered today. A little bit. It's not gonna last for very long. <laughs> hopefully, smile, smile, give him a smile to the camera. Just yeah, smile to the camera. We'll zoom in. Yeah, we'll zoom in later. We'll yeah, we'll later. zoom in later. Uh, play by what, play. What play, play. play by play? What happened? Yeah. How did? Then my nothing got uh, into the mic, into the mic. At the end of the Kanina, for everyone who's uh, asking, uh, simply, marami na nagulat kanina when I posted the pic. But, um, ito guys, so I think it was Chris Kuhn. I think either you were guarding him. I think uh, he was coming down uh, off a ball screen and then um, I was helping. I was hedging on the screen. And then I think he either lost the ball or I tipped it. And so I, I it, the ball went to the right and I, I dove for the ball. And then it was a good play. Nothing, nothing. And Nina Mantina Jatni and Chris Kuhn, you know, everything was as good sportsmanship. But I dove on the play for the ball and I was like, ah, it's good. <laughs> <laughs> and either Chris Kuhn or somebody fell on top of me. And then while I was screaming, my face, this is the court. My face was like this, boom. <laughs> and as soon as the, I, I just saw something, boom, fly out of my mouth. And I kind of go do mo do go talaga yung yung mouth ko talaga. And I, I thought like I thought my whole entire fr- all my front teeth were like hanging. Do that, do that, do that thing again. And I was like I was like this, I boom, and then literally open mouth, open like this, boom. <laughs> my teeth hurt when you did that. That sounds worse describing it now than watching it. Good. I thought all this. I thought it was like all this was hanging. I looked the the first thing I did. I looked at Ben. I was like Ben. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't tell. I was like, it looks like there's a hole there, but I, I couldn't tell. So I just said, like, keep playing, keep playing, keep playing. I, I thought it was bleeding. I didn't know until yeah, after the game because, all right, so I, I, I seen you die on the ball. I was like, oh, okay, it's a, it's a dive. And then I seen Earl just run over and pick some up. And I'm like, <laughs> man, some, someone, someone was playing in, in earrings? Like, some yeah. earrings? Yeah. And they picked it up like this. I'm like, oh, I didn't think anything of it until I think. um we get in the locker room and you start smiling. I said, "Oh, <laughs> what the hell happened to you?" <laughs> like, oh man, I didn't hit my teeth on the floor. I really like. I wouldn't. Know, I didn't even know until we really got in the locker room. But everybody's so locked in, saying, so, you know, "I can't make a joke." So I see him. I look at Mike. I said, oh, hey, "You good, Mike? You good, Mike?" He opened his mouth. I said, "Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> what happened to you, too, brother?" <laughs> He said, oh, it's right here. <laughs> it's in the Ziploc bag, right? Yeah, Ziploc bag. Let's get locked in again. Let's get locked in again. We'll talk well, about this uh, after well, the game. Let's talk about, let's talk about Sean. Mid-range Shawnee. Uh, Pull talk, up three, Shawnee. Walk me through that first quarter. I mean, they're, they're locking in on you. Their defensive schemes are all up on you. I think you had zero, and then you ended with, with 25. I mean, I mean, tell us how you just get over that hump and how you delivered in those clutch moments, my man. Honestly, Coach Tab is a great coach. Mm-hmm. Great man, coach. they was taking away everything. Everything yeah. I did well, or our team did well, they took it away. Mm-hmm. Like they made us go to our second option or our counters. I mean, I oh, how to do counters? How to do all that? I'm like, man, they so know all the plays. Yeah, they look like they really like. We were prepared. They were prepared. Like it was. They like, knew the plays even before we called them. Yeah, yeah. They, 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 they could tell. Like, trying to sneak the plays in, and they're over here like, oh, it looks like this formation. This is what they're running. I'm like, I mean, we should be like, all right, don't call the plays. Like, let's call it when we're in the backcourt, but don't we call it. In there. They was like, pistol, pistol. They, like, they knew. They knew from the setup. Yeah. I, was like, we didn't, I know. He was like, we didn't even call yet. I was like, oh, man, they I locked like, in. Like, dude, one time I was like, damn, what are we running? And, and they, they called it and, out. And, 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 and they I called it, it out. Pistol. He was like, pistol. I was like, oh, thanks, man. <laughs> <laughs> he said, thanks, man. Man, so they was, they was really like, man, they was locked in. And it, I remember the first shot. No, I remember the first shot I shot at Raquame. And I was like, man, he tall. Yeah, I, yeah. I really almost got my shot blocked. I was like, all right. I think it just hit straight back. But I was like, all right, all right okay, okay. And I got a mid range, and I was like, oh, missed it. And I got the rebound. And I was like, all right, let me just get an easy layup. Kwame glassed it. And I said, oh man. <laughs> I said, oh, man. <laughs> it's alone night everywhere. I, said, oh, no, no, I didn't even think he reached that far. I was like, oh man, this guy big as hell. Yep, yep. Jeremy comes slapping the middle. Hey, bro, you got you. <laughs> no, no, that's not what I said. Go slapping the first quarter. I said. 
Hey, stay composed, brother. Stay composed. <laughs> oh, you're gonna be all right. You're gonna be all right. To you, anyways. Damn. <laughs> he be so locked in. It's crazy. I was listening to you. I'm you should see him before the game. You you would talk to him. He would just walk right by you. Hey, no emotions. <laughs> nothing like he like he never hears nothing. I, I actually don't think he blinks before games. I, so I don't know how his eyes stay wet during the games because he don't be blinking. Oh my God, Ben, boy. Yeah. I, yo 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 yo. <laughs> you before the game is crazy. Dude is mean mugging the whole time before the game. He has a whole meme mug face 24-7 before the game. I've never seen it off of him. <laughs> <laughs> he just like, I'm like, dang, bro, you got, you just, I know you, I know your eyebrows hurt, bro. Ain't no way, bro. I know they hurt, bro. There's no way. Oh, man. But I, I love it, though. I love it. He's locked in. Man, All right, so you, you, you got to see what the experience is like. You, yep. You, you, you getting ready for next year? Oh, I'm definitely getting ready. Mm. Working hard as I can. You know it. Yep. yep. It's funny, most people would think we'd be out partying right now, but nah. Yeah. We out here shooting this video for y'all. Yeah. But and we got another game Wednesday. It's, yep. it's we not, practice, so we got practice. We practice tomorrow. Tomorrow. Yeah, we have, we have practice tomorrow morning. So <laughs> I got class. Yeah, we got class. Yeah. We still got lives. We still got yeah, stuff yeah, to do. Crazy. We got I mean, it was the third game of the season. We already had UP Ateneo, so we gotta stay locked in and it's just the first round. So Yeah, still it was just the first round. But really it was student days. athletes. Really the atmosphere athletes. really felt like it was a finals yeah. game. I, I, mean, I think the total crazy. gate attendance was something like like twelve thousand. Yeah. Really? Well, like forty. So, so it, it, I mean with the drums, with I mean I Yeah, explain, I, explain no, the atmosphere. The, the, atmosphere. The, big, the biggest thing I always get chills is when we have timeouts. Yeah. And they're like, D. I was like, oh, hold on, coach. I was like, well, I had to look up and enjoy the moment. Really? Yeah, because yeah. a lot of times I'm too locked in, but I, I just I just look and, and just see the whole entire side of Aranet that's just green. That's what I'm saying. All right, so I see green and blue. All right, that my moment for that is when I'm at the free throw line. Yo. Because, like, you literally sit, the whole gym is watching you. It's crazy. And, like, you get the ball, and then the drums start beating. And it feels like an anthem to me. I don't know how yeah, to explain yeah. it. Like, it's just like, but right, once you get the ball, they just start beating the drum, boom, 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 boom. And I'm just like, looking around, I'm like. There, there, yeah. there, there's, a, there's a sequence in the game uh, when I hit my first three and the whole left side, like my whole left eardrum almost busted because all of the De La Salle people went crazy. And then Kai Balloon Guy comes down and he hits a three and the whole right side goes crazy. And then I come down and hit another three, but it was just. It's those things that you really like, you really you need them. You can't need a mahali you and you can't yeah, yeah. you can't it's something that opens yeah. with you. You yeah. can't forget it ever. Like, yeah. Uh, man. I'm sorry if you see me looking at Ben and Mike weird when they speak Filipino, it's just crazy. Right? <laughs> it's how they can do both sides. That's crazy. The God love. Or yeah. You I'm trying to learn it. I'm trying to learn it. Yeah, you can get yep. there. Uh, flashcards. Yep, yep. flashcards. Flash cards. Duolingo. Yep. Yeah. Uh what was your experience? We might as well go down and, and what was your experience down the line? Uh, of this game, oh, yeah. because it's our first, it's yeah, literally yeah. our first at the nail the sour rivalry. So, what is it? What is the experience? Yeah, I mean, this one was just different because it wasn't like the bubble where at first we had no fans. That first game, second game, we had maybe fifty percent fans, but this was like this was a completely different experience. So, last two minutes, if I can recall, I didn't move out of my seat because I was just I was so. Uh, stuck in that moment you know we were making stops people were hitting threes Nelly was hitting his two free throws we were you know we were we were locking them down and the time kept going down but it felt like they were just still there like like we all talk about it because we just finished watching um the 2008 redeem redeem team oh Dr. Kobe Dr. yeah we were locked in and, and and it was just like it felt like that same moment where Spain was just on their heels I was like man like these eagles will not go away like we could Dang. never put them away and so it really went down to the why we were up, we were down by 12 and we were up by 12. Then at the last two minutes, it was like just two, three, four, five points. Uh, but it was just, that, that's when you really need that six man. I mean, I, I truly felt like the LaSalle community, they were yelling, they were screaming. They were even coming down and, and saying, you know, words to the bench. And I was just like, I, I yeah. couldn't believe, that's why I was getting so teary eyed. Like, and I never really cry for real. Hey. Like, like, I, like, it, like. <laughs> <laughs> five five years five years we had never gotten over that hump and and we and they always bring in the alumni guys to talk to us drawn tangs all of the old coaches the old community they just say just win that Ateneo game we haven't felt that since 2017 to be able to bring that back it's 2022 now five years and be a part of that redeem team I mean it's sober Masayako sober Masaya yeah I agree right. with you before you before Mike goes what was your experience when you looked at Ben after the game like, what oh, was man. Ben doing man 
he was half crying and half not crying. <laughs> so he has the facial expression of crying, but there's no tears coming out. <laughs> so it was just stuck like that for a good five minutes. I'm looking, I'm like, okay, is he going to cry or is he just going to keep the face? <laughs> and it's like, okay, I guess he's just going to keep the face. And we did our alma mater and then, yeah. All right, Mike. That's basically it. Uh, what, what was your experience? Down the stretch. Down the stretch. All right, yeah, we could. Yeah, whatever you want to just like mm -hmm. say about the game. Nah, for your me, experience. you know, like for my role in the team, I really love my role because I, I like being that support guy for guys like Shawnee, guys like Baldy, Kurt, you know, just helping them out. And like for me, I feel like almost like Farang, I'm also like a fan. Like I'm watching because for me, like yeah. rebounding, like hustle defense, and then like. For me, I'm just be able to watch like Shiny go to work, watch Evan, watch Earl go to work, and I'm just like, here, sick, wow, wow. Angling talaga ma kakampi ko ma kasama ko like, um, like I just seeing like, oh, I'm get like I'm in position for the rebound. Boom, goes in, goes out. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, and real real quick, even to add to that, like I have so much respect for for the guys that are like in in my in my roles. Like, there's no even behind the scenes. Like, not a lot of people know this. There's no better feeling than setting a really good screen. And then, someone, the and, then, and then someone knocking that down. Like, there's one play, I missed third quarter opening. I missed my three, get the rebound. I give it to Sean, set a good screen for Sean. He ben, comes sets, around, ben sets the best screen. He comes around and knocks it down, and it's just like, that stuff won't yeah. ever get. That's the thing that's, that's, that's really, that's that's really I remember that. Our team is that, that yeah. it's, not, it's not really just, like, one person. Of course, you're going to have guys, shiny go off. But the thing is, like, it was really a whole team effort, whole team. and it man, need man, corny talaga. Yun talaga nang yari, you know, tonight. That's some, something we can really help to build on. Is that we got con contributions from guys like Shawnee, Cortez, or Cortez. Abadam. What What do you think of uh, Earl and Penny? I feel like they really stepped yeah, up. Yeah, they really this. stepped up. I mean, oh. especially for Earl. You know, he got some minutes in yeah. the USD game, but for him to really come out this in a game, high pressure and, game, in a high pressure game, in that atmosphere, and to be there really in those crucial minutes, both of them, yeah, yeah. both Amen. of them, and so like all of them, shit. yeah, yeah. yeah. Raven, you know, Raven, all of them, oh man, yeah, yeah. yeah. Raven. I, yeah. I mean, guys stepping up. Raven stepped up. I had two fouls. Bright was in the foul trouble, yeah. and unfortunately, you know, Mark got hurt uh, in, in the in the first half, and so um, Penny really stepped up when you know Man. Evan. You know, and so like, hey, Penny over here hit a step back three. I was like, yeah. oh, there, there, there's certain moments like with our team where if people do stuff like that. You already know, like, dude, we got this. Like, yeah. like sometimes it's, it's it's when Sean just goes off on that streaky mid range, or if we have the bench guys coming in, Raven running the lane and, and finishing plays. This is so good. Rebounds, it's so good to see. You see, like guys like like uh, Abadam. You see guys like Penny. Even guys like I see who putting in so much work. So much work. Um, you know, like they're staying after practice. They're going before everyone, and they're putting so much time. You know, in scout teams and helping us in practice. And so when they really get in the game and they really show what they can do, it's just. So to see those guys going and yeah. it's just you just want to root for them you know Absolutely. Uh, of them and so i just i just i can't wait to see i know um that's one of the things i really like about our, our team is that we're really really close and anybody can really um contribute to everybody yeah I, I, man that is yeah. well said well jeremy you got anything to say about the just experience or what you want to say to people or Five years down the line, you look at this video, you just want to, man, that's the, that's what that felt like. Yeah. No, yeah, man, like it, this it's video just, is going to be out here for a while. So you, yeah. what, what do you, what are you feeling in this moment? So if you I watch feel, this video again, you'd be like, man, I did feel that way. Uh, it's a, uh, all, everything right now for me is just a learning experience. So I'm glad I get to witness this and watch everything before I get out on the court. I'm just, I'm just taking it all in learning and learning from the guys like you, you know, Mark Shani, Mike, mm -hmm. Ben, you know, they really helped me. They take after, they, um, they help, they're helping me grow in this, in this, you know, in this time. And I really appreciate it. But, um, it was definitely a crazy experience. So the game was, energy was crazy. I'm, mm -hmm. I, I never stand it up for a whole game in my life. <laughs> I know those I hurt. never met. That's the crazy. It wasn't even hurting. My legs were not hurting. Usually my legs were hurt. Jeez. And I was just, it was, I was locked in. Like I said, I felt like I was, I'm in the huddle looking at all the plays and everything. Like it was just, it was a great, it was a great experience. I'm, I'm glad I'm a part of the uh, LaSalle community. That, that, was, that, was, that was the difference, I think, from last, last season. Last season's Ateneo games, I, I, I felt really nervous, and even in the game, I still felt nervous yeah. last season. You know, but but coming into this season, we felt more like a team. Yeah, I, yeah. I felt more like, comfortable as a, with a team, offense and defense, pre-game, 
halftime, everything, even when we were down, I, I knew that, okay, even though we're down 12, 14, like, it's just time for us to make our run. You know Whereas that maybe is? last season it was different. You know what that is? That's just game experience. Yeah. You played. Yeah. You played last. That's just game experience. So you, yeah. you know, used to it. Mm -hmm. Like I said, that's why I'm glad I get to watch and learn. And Absolutely. Get, yeah. get some of the experience by just right. watching. Shawnee, you know, to close out, would it have any closing remarks about your experience today? Uh, I, I didn't know what you said. I was looking at the tooth. <laughs> <laughs> What? I was like, I was like, man, what the hell? <laughs> I was looking at the list. I was like, oh man. Hey, I, I didn't hear. What he said he was looking at he the two. I was looking at the whole. Like, <laughs> the whole I'm like, oh, so crazy. No, I, my last words. Um, no, not your last. I, I, words. I, I, mid range I, assassin. I, I, mid -range I have assassin. a question. My my question. Mid range Sean, assassin. Because I, I went back and watched the last two minutes. You had like three of the last crucial buckets. <laughs> Like what goes through your mind when it's when games on the line like that and all the pressures on you to make that not just make the shot but take the shot first and then make it. All right, reporter Ben. Uh, <laughs> hey, you like a news anchor, aren't you? <laughs> Anybody need a news anchor? <laughs> we got him right here. He, we got Ben. He knows everything. He's yep. Yep, businessman Ben. Uh, no, nah, it was you know the crazy part. I was I literally just going to the gym and I sh I shot that exact same shot. Yeah. No, like you don't. You don't even remember. You were talking about you know that pull up three you had off the dribble. You yeah. shot that last night. Yeah, I watched you shoot that shot. Man. You with your, you, you, oh with my dad. Yeah, dad, yeah. I was like literally oh. every shot I took, I take, is like practice. Like you guys don't like I don't count. Like oh, I'll make ten. I just shoot it until it feels good. And I'm yeah. Like, but I literally I kid you not. Last night that same shot I was like man, me and my dad were literally just shooting that same shot. Mm. Like. And it was just it just happened. Like, I don't even know what the play was called. I was like, all right. And all right, this is the crazy part. Both my legs was cramping up. <laughs> I didn't think the shot. I was like, I shot it and I jumped and I said, like, oh, my legs is cramping up. Let me just hold the follow through a little extra long just to make sure. <laughs> just to make sure that two K glitched. I was like, oh, both the calves was cramping up and, and both shots I took. Um, but I don't know. It's just, bro. I kid you not. It's just. Shots you, it's like shots you practice. Once that pull up three went in, I was like, Oh, yeah, the game's over. Oh, the pull oh, yeah. through is we crazy. winning, <laughs> the game's finalized. It's crazy because yeah. you was, I don't usually shoot those shots, Pooping, bro. Those pull up, you know, that was that was the screen you said. Yep. Ben sets the best screens, yep. but no, I came off he, and I just shot it. Too. And it was like a regular pull up. And then they said, Shawnee for three. And I said, Oh, that was a, <laughs> that was a three. I said, I didn't even know that was a three. But, um, I, if like looking back, this it feels good just because. It's been so long since yeah, like, yeah, the yeah. community uh, won this in particular game. I mean, it's just compared to the huge big picture, this is a huge part for like the South community. But I feel like we're going to face them again, like in round two. So, like, we yep. still like we still it wasn't an easy game. To, it wasn't like it wasn't an easy game. They was there the whole time. And yeah. it's major respect to, to yeah. all the whole team. Kwame was killing. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. we definitely had like personally, like, we can celebrate, but we have like things to. To learn from and like look at going mm -hmm. into the next game because yeah uh number one killed us on the boards yeah Kwame really like he did step backs and crazy I was yeah. like man yeah. so like we we definitely gotta we have some things to look at and and uh we won so we can look at the things that we did good but we also did some things that we did bad just going into round two we're gonna face him again and, and probably in the playoffs somewhere so I feel good about the win yeah. but I just know like Oh yeah, this this ain't it. Like this, this, this is like yeah. this just the start. Is, like, yeah, you know Step something like just regular season. Yeah, it's just the start just of a season. season. Yeah, it's not something we can be too happy about. Yeah, yeah, like it's something to celebrate, but it's nothing like this. Not it. Like you can't get too high. Mm -hmm. You can't get too yeah, low we, neither. Just we over here about yeah. to go to practice tomorrow. Yeah. 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 Watch yeah. film at twelve. Stay, stay, yeah. stay grounded. We just gotta stay yeah. grounded. But I mean, yeah, it's it's hard to say. Like you know what I'm saying. Like mm -hmm. you gotta stay balanced. But like I definitely respect the team. Like they they are great. Hey, I'm, great preparation. Great hey, it was great execution. Dude. Yeah, but I mean, we got to come out round two and compete with them again. And y'all should definitely come and watch the game and sell yeah, out the game like again. And yeah. shout out. And then we might even do a ticket giveaway. Wow. Like, okay. Oh, hey, hey you ticket giveaways. You know what I'm saying, like, yeah. go ahead, shout the shout the podcast out right now. You ticket giveaway. Go ahead, subscribe. We might players only. Players, only. players only. Ticket say it, giveaway. Say it in Filipino. Say yeah. it in Filipino. Uh, a ticket giveaway. Ticket giveaway. Uh, I wasn't doing today, but I was like. I literally was gonna do a ticket giveaway today because I, I'm not gonna say what I have because people are gonna be mad. Like, oh, you didn't give me a ticket, but I had. I was like, uh, forget it. But I was gonna like, um, I was gonna do a ticket giveaway. But I was like, all right, now nah, we gotta get this win first. Like, hey. gotta stay, I gotta, you gotta stay locked in. Like, 
no matter what, you gotta you gotta stay locked in. But next next round, I feel like we should do like a ticket giveaway. It's like a fan or something like that. Because mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I know a lot of people want to go to the games. It's hard to get tickets yeah. to these games. So yeah. like if we just, I know somebody out there that just we might have an extra ticket or two laying around and make some fans day or something like that just to come watch us live and support us live. Absolutely, people that can only watch on the TV. So just try to help out like the LaSalle community and stuff like that. So. Put that in Tagalog. Put that in Tagalog. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead, Mythical Mike. End it out. End it out. Yep. End it out. Ayun lang. Para mga namin, salamat sa lahat na napanood itong video na to, itong podcast na to. This is Players Only. Uh, ako, Michael Phillips. Yung kuya ko. Ben Phillips. Ben Phillips. Uh, Jeremy Robinson. And Johnny, Johnny wins. Kaya mo na. Johnny wins. So, para mga namin, salamat. Uh, the silent community. Uh, this is not, uh, this is not uh, the end. This is only the beginning. 